Hi, it's Grace, and today we've got miniatures, mascara, mail, and of course morning. I had to make them all M words because that's just fun. So um, I guess I will start with showing you stuff, and I'll talk about it while I'm like playing with. Well, I put in the thumbnail. New mascara, needed a new one. So this, um, I'll show you a picture of bleh, all the stuff lying around to make the tiny house. Um, and I didn't think about which way this wire went through, uh, so it's kind of back to front, but that's okay. You can only see like, um, I don't even know if you can see it on camera. There's tiny lines, but I'm pretty sure that it's not going to matter. One, it's on the back and two, if I want, I can just put like whatever over it, make like tiny cat posters or something. It'll be fine. Um, so that's where we're up to with that. I need to figure out how to start gluing that together. Uh, another job for not today. Um, probably job for not this week, I'm going to be honest. I'm in a lot of pain today, so I've just been trying to sit still and do stuff. So tiny arts and crafts are cute. I made a giant Kmart order. <laughs> it's a lot of stuff, but I suddenly got excited about Halloween. Um, I was thinking about it anyway, but some stuff happened and I was like you all know what might be a very nice idea to celebrate Halloween so fingers crossed I can organize that um it's kind of nice to have something positive to think about in the future and Halloween is one of my favorite times of year so I figured I should celebrate it while I'm feeling the most sad that makes the most sense to me all right mascara before I forget what I was doing this is the colossal colossal oh my goodness the Colossal by Maybelline and this is the 36 hour waterproof one. Um, I have used the waterproof regular Colossal and the Colossal Curl Bounce. I'm currently using this. I like it. So why not try something a little bit different again but kind of the same. I should get my hair out of my face or it's going to get streaks which honestly isn't the worst thing. But I washed my hair yesterday so I kind of don't want to do that. Oh, I should have warmed up this curler. Oh well, it just won't hold the curl as well. That'll be fine. And I guess it's kind of hard to compare these two mascaras because one's a few months old. Oh, not a few months old. Uh, I don't know. Oh, okay. That was my stinky thing running out of stink. Um, how old is that? Oh, God knows. Anyway, it's probably about time I got a new one. It's like that with mascara. And... Mm, all right, hang on. One more on that side. All right, that is before and curl, just in case you wanted to know. And I will put this one on this side, maybe. So I'm still feeling awful about my life. Halloween has given me a tiny happy because the whole kitten thing has become overwhelming. I don't want to use my loneliness as an excuse or my grief as an excuse just to get another pet at the moment with what would be quickest. I need to take so many things into consideration so as desperate as I am to fill that void I'm just taking my time well we are taking our time to make sure we are making the best decision possible. Um, I said to my partner like we have to be realistic about this and did I say this the other day? Probably. You can hear it again. Um, potentially the next time this situation comes around again we're going to be a lot closer to 60 than we are now. Well, I guess it depends which way you look at it, but certainly it's going to be um, a little while in the future. So you need to weigh up a lot of issues. Like, I'm an issue. I have to make sure that, and not everyone's going to be the same. I would like to go personally pick up this kitten. And it seems hard to do. But hopefully it'll be part of the process, it'll help. I know I'm just going to cry my butt off the whole time. <sighs> but it'll be for all the right reasons, hopefully. Um, and it'll always, always, every day, I'll think about Luna. And it doesn't get any easier. And I can't cry right now because this stuff's not dry. Um, but I would like to think that she doesn't want to see... Well, she might want to see me this sad. 
not really but one of her favorite things to do like she knew where people hurt and what like if she was in a particularly pissy mood um, and you weren't doing something she wanted she would um, like if I had a sore belly she'd come and pretend well not pretend maybe pretend <laughs> to sit on my stomach like get a cuddle and stuff and just like she'll just be sitting there and then all of a sudden she'll just like launch off and kick you really hard and be like ha ha take that and keep running I've known cats to do it before but just living with it all the time like at this age was just hilarious because Luna would do it to me if she was annoyed at me but she also learnt where um I don't know how to put this. My brain just said male storage compartment. That is not right, but you can figure that out on your own. Um, the positioning and squishiness of the area and where to jam a foot to make it really hurt when she launches her full body weight off it. <laughs> and that was um, interesting and special. So I know that she liked to see us in a tiny bit of pain, but I don't think she'd like it like this. This really sucks. I just really want us to have a tiny bit of joy again because we're not having a fun time. We're not enjoying any part of our days apart from, you know, we're spending time with each other, but we're both so sad. I know we're gonna get through this. I believe in us. It's fine. Whew, but in saying that, I don't want us to have to live like this when we have options when we're ready emotionally and hmm, financially and I was gonna say I'm gonna wait till I'm healthier but <sighs> look that's not gonna happen anytime soon so maybe I can just have a new friend and someone that likes napping staying in bed where it's cozy I don't think that's a bad time so um I really need to just finish my mascara I can't get on tangents too much today. I say it like, how many minutes in? Yeah, like 10 minutes in. Ooh, this is kind of nice. It's a bit lighter than the other formula. Or maybe it's just because it's a fresh one and the other one's dried. <laughs> and I probably just had it sitting out talking instead of putting it on before. Always a good move. All right, again, I can't overly compare them because one is a lot older than the other. But I do like this new one. So we'll see how it goes with age as well. Because sometimes things start out really cool and they get gross. And sometimes it is opposite. I cannot tell you a mascara that I have used that has been consistent the whole way from opening it to throwing it out. Well, you know, three months or so. Oh, uh, did I get hair in this? Oh, gross. All right. So quickly, this is this mascara. All right. So that was pretty quick, but I like it. Mm hmm that looks pretty good marvelous and um, what was I talking about kittens still not ready all right I will um, oh I'll talk about it another day when I'm not testing fresh mascara oh my gosh okay this finally turned up I ordered this in I want to say August <laughs> But it was only a couple of dollars and it did come on a slow boat. So I wasn't expecting it before Christmas, I'm going to be honest. But showed up. Good times. This is supposed to be like a poison ring, but I don't know exactly how it works. Slide out the side. Something like that. Oh. Slide out that side maybe. Hang on. Slide. That's kind of cool. It's kind of chunky. I thought it was going to be a little bit more discreet than that, but that's like really obvious. Hang on. Will you focus? Maybe. Yeah, that's kind of obvious that it opens up. Not that I didn't want it to be, but you know, some poison rings are pretty discreet. And some lockets, like, I don't know. The hinge kind of gives it away, I guess. But some of them open differently and it's not quite as obvious. My God, I don't think I could ever open this. So I don't think I should ever put anything in it. Oh my goodness. That's it. I need help. <sighs> it just fell out. Awesome. Yeah, I don't think I could actually fit anything in there anyway, but it's a really cool idea. I think that's a pretty fun time, and I don't know which finger it's going to fit on. Oh, not that one. Hang on. This one. 
all right that's a bit cool oh my fingers are a bit swollen today so hopefully I will fit better another day but it looks cool yeah I really like that shiny all right I think that's it hopefully I'll see you tomorrow or the next day or the next day or yeah just soon um overall I'm feeling like mentally a little bit better but again I think it might be those drugs I'll have to find out all right cool see you soon bye